I have here a 2006 Subaru Outback LL Bean with the 863.0 engine and the 5EAT automatic transmission. This is my rural mail delivery car, so I get extra paranoid about uh, transmission in particular and head gaskets and all that stuff because Lord knows I've gone through plenty of those in the past on other vehicles. In 2012, I went through, what was it? I think this Subaru was my uh, fourth or fifth car of the year. <laughs> Changing out the transmission oil and filter with really, really, some really nice uh, royal purple stuff. And the question came to me, where the hell's the damn filter? Well, that's odd. It doesn't seem to be on this side of the transmission of the oil pan and oddly enough it doesn't seem to be on this side of the transmission either like some other Subarus. So of course if you go online and buy a filter for your 2006 Outback with the 3.0 you're going to get a spin-on filter like one of these guys. So, you know, of course, it's not in the uh, pan, uh, which is right there. I took that off so I could clean out the inside and put a larger magnet in there and stuff like that. Because I'm paranoid that way. Um, you know where it is? It's hidden behind the frickin' battery, which I've already moved it out of the way. You can't even see the damn thing when the battery is in place. But that... I don't even know if you can see that. Um, and yes, I know I need to replace my battery. But yes, it's tucked in there behind the battery in the side of the car. That's where it is. What a pain in the ass. I couldn't find any documentation or photographs or anything that, that would tell me where it is. So that's, there you go. That's where the damn filter is and they say every 100,000 miles again I'm paranoid sorry I placed it I also put in a transmission cooler and hopefully this car will last me until I get it paid off in four and a half years <laughs> all right